So here all I need to do is turn on my iPad. So the app that we use is NumPad Pro. You see here it shows my Mac Studio, my MacBook Pro, which is somewhere else on the network in a, in a different room, and the iMac, which is the iMac here, which is my iMac 5K. So you can select any one of those. Remember, these are all asleep at the moment. So what I can then do is select the Mac Studio. And you can see on the screen, I've got a return button just at the bottom where my thumb is. I'm going to tap the return button. And that has woken up that uh, Mac Studio. I can then go back up to the top here where my thumb is, tap the top left, select the iMac and do the same. Hit the return button. Now I can actually put in my password because I've got that stored under my little lock icon. So that's my uh, password to wake up that iMac. Tap that and it's opened up the iMac. And then if you're a lunar display user, we can see the lunar display interface there waiting for this uh, iMac to open up lunar display secondary. So I can launch lunar display secondary with this lunar display icon just under my thumb. So I'll touch that. And then we'll see both of them connect. And there we are, we have a connection between the two. And I can move that screen that interface from one to the other. There we are. That's how I would commonly wake up both of my computers from sleep. And if I wanted to, at the end of the day, I could select the iMac again. You can see it's selected at the top and hit the quit to quit the Lunar Display secondary app and then hit the sleep button. And then I could go back and select Mac Studio and essentially just hit the sleep button and it will sleep the Mac Studio and we're back to a situation where you've just seen me wake it all up from. That's Remote, Numpad and Keypad Pro with the Lunar Display.